deepfakes are essentially a type of synthetic media, and synthetic media is any digital media, audio, video, text, images, that are manipulated by or generated by artificial intelligence. And now we are looking at a world where AI can generate unique images and soon video merely based on textual prompts. One of the recent applications has been in the field of AI-generated art. And the big breakthrough point for AI art are these text-to-image generation models. Photorealistic, utopia, drones, flower garden. Yes, this technology is democratizing in the sense that everybody is able to access it and play around with it, but to create something of real artistic value, you still have to decide what is the prompt, you know, what is the idea? What can we learn from the artwork that's created by artificial intelligence? There is a lot humans can learn from art created by artificial intelligence. I think it's a great way for machines to express themselves and their creativity. Primarily, I think that humans can learn to be more open-minded from art created by artificial intelligence because it is not restricted by the limit of human comprehension. So AI image generation, what is it? Because it's not uh, easy for the common person to understand. You know, uh, you can give just a sentence of text. You know, a dog riding a skateboard is uh, happy to live in the big city. And you'll get the, an image generated of a dog on a skateboard smiling and skating through a big city. Gobsmacking, you know, where did this come from? It came from the fact that there are millions of photographs of dogs, millions of photographs of skateboards, millions of photographs of cities, and the AI can basically fuse all these elements together and generate new, uh, completely unique images from that. This, as a medium, even though it's using this AI tool to generate it, is actually becoming a tool to create art that's never existed before. I think the big difference when you consider the age of AI is that this is no longer technological innovation. That AI is basically going to be the machine that powers all content production, whether or not it's a good or bad thing. The emphasis, which used to be much more on disinformation, pernicious uses of synthetic media in the form of non-consensual stealing of one's identity, starting in pornography, but then also emanating out to fraud and cybersecurity issues. The balance has shifted now more to the creative potential of this technology. This, as a medium, is actually becoming a tool for a new form of artistry. Just like photography, it must have been transformative when all of a sudden, instead of studying a landscape, picking all the pigments for your color, laboring at painting that landscape on a canvas, cameras came around and with the click of a button, you could capture that landscape. And I think the same thing is going to happen with AI-generated art. Artificial intelligence is going to become the medium by which most humans produce all digital content.